The economic and social turmoil that followed the collapse of the Soviet Union has resulted in untold numbers of personal tragedies. While the end of communist rule has led to many positive political and economic changes in people's lives, it's also led to family breakdown, growing poverty and an increase in alcoholism. One of the saddest social indicators is the number of children now forced to live and work on Russian streets. It's a totally new phenomenon. Today, estimates show there are one million homeless children throughout Russia. In St. Petersburg alone, there are 16,000 street children. It's a situation Russian President Vladimir Putin has summed up as the most threatening of his country's economic and social indicators. The whole system was destroyed and the system of values was destroyed as well. And many people, they don't believe in their future. They don't have any ideals because uh, they don't believe in that ideals which existed in the former Soviet Union and the new ideals uh, hadn't been invented for them. The relations of people are destroyed and parents uh, don't take care of their children. Max is 13 and Yuri 11. They live in the eastern suburbs of St. Petersburg. They sleep in the attic at the top of this eight-story housing block. In the winter, they sleep in the basement. This is our cushion. We sleep on it. We use it instead of a pillow. When it is warm, we use our jackets as a pillow, while the cats sleep on this one. This is our typical food for the day. We eat macaroni, dry pasta. We don't eat hot food because we've got nowhere to cook it. This is our hiding place. We hide all the most important things here, but they always go missing. <laughs> 